Okay guys, a quick installation video. Um, for those of you who ordered in bulk order, I couldn't assemble the units um, to fit in the same packaging, which they're all currently boxed up over here. Um, so for those of you that I had to put two units or more in the box, um, there was no way to fully assemble it and stack the units, otherwise the box would be too large and then the shipping cost would be twice as high. Um, so just a quick install video for those of you um, who didn't order just one unit. Um, everyone that ordered just one um, coming to you, is a, this is already fully assembled. Uh, so you don't have to worry about this part of the video. All right. Um, the first thing you're going to do is remove the four rubber um, mounting points from your original um, stock cover. These four are located in the same places underneath your cover. And they just come out by simply squeezing the sides together like so and then pulling through a slot in the in the front here so you just squeeze and remove through the slot um, so it's pretty simple they're not glued in or screwed in they just simply pop into place um, so once you remove those four from your stock cover just install them onto your new piece here once you have those four rubber sockets in you can move this cover underneath and line it up with your carbon fiber piece it can only go on one way so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna look for the holes and line up each hole with the screw hole here all the way around you can see the holes lining up there for the screw holes as they go around the perimeter here um, once you have that in place there's also so what we're gonna have here is once you have it lined up you're gonna have one two three four five, six, seven, eight screws around the perimeter of the uh, aluminum cover. So the, the screw is going to go through the aluminum cover, through the carbon, and into your um, plastic mounting point um, for the engine. So once you get those three lined up, put the engine cover on and line that up so that you can see through the hole through the carbon into the plastic cover and then you got a bag full of m4 screws all in the same length and you're going to stick that through the hole wiggle it around until you get it to go all the way through now you will have to hold up the plastic part on the bottom at the same time so that you can get it into the hole correctly um, I would recommend just getting something to something short to put underneath make it easier for you to hold it up so you can screw it down and you'll use a metric uh, allen wrench a number three and Take that and screw all eight um, screws around the perimeter here. Once you got those in place, you have two more. So one and two. And these actually mount up directly to the mounting points on the engine cover um, to give it structure. So once you get the middle perimeter in um, the two side ones uh, one in the back here one in the front so a total of 10 10 bolts all together um, 
very simple. Once you get all those put in place, um, you're ready to go. Um, that's for um, only for the bulk orders. Everyone else is going to have a fully assembled unit just as it is, and you're just going to put in the rubber stoppers from your stock um, cover on the four points, and you're ready to go. Um, and that's about it.